The Pro 9541 WT is the latest addition to Oki's white toner range. It offers the transfer print industry the critical ability to print a backing layer of solid white behind colors. This ensures that these colors stay vibrant even on dark backgrounds. It provides a solution for three applications. This is the simplest way to transfer a digital image onto various substrates. For this process, you'll require the Pro 9541 WT, a heat press, and some transfer media. Start by using the Oki Pro 9541 WT to print a high-resolution image onto quality transfer paper. Position your printed transfer paper, the A-foil, with the glossy side facing down. Position the B-paper on top of the foil. Cover with a sheet of finishing paper and some additional sheets of regular paper. The press time will depend on the heat press and media you are using. Peel the sheets apart in a flat, constant and fluid motion. Now trim the edges of the A-foil to ensure a clean result. Before transferring the image, it is advisable to preheat the garments to remove any moisture and ensure a perfectly flat fabric surface. Position the A-fold transfer onto the textile with the glossy side facing up. Press time is once again dependent on your setup. Remove the textile from the press and place on a flat surface to cool down completely. Remove the A-foil carefully with your fingertips and the palm of your hand in a flat, rolling motion. Position the textile back onto the press and cover with matte or gloss finishing paper, dependent on your requirements. Press again. The transfer is now complete. The addition of white toner behind the design ensures bright, vibrant colors. The use of digital transfer media is a new and innovative way to make the screen printing stencil preparation process faster and easier, as well as eliminating the chemicals usually required. For this application, you'll need the Pro 9541 WT, a blank screen printing frame, one or two heat presses, and suitable transfer media. This process begins with preparing your stencil art from the original design. For traditional screen printing, you'll need to create a stencil for each color being printed, starting with creating color separations in your graphic software. Using the Oki Pro 9541 WT, print these separations as a series of images onto imaging sheets, printed right reading in a negative stencil format. Due to its greater opacity, using the white toner is recommended. Each stencil image is then covered with a layer of adhesive paper and heat pressed. Temperature, pressure and time will vary according to your particular press. Immediately and carefully, peel the adhesive paper away from the imaging sheet in one smooth and constant movement. This process is then repeated for each color separation required. The screen printing frame and mesh are placed front side up onto the heat press. Now place the prepared imaging sheet, image side down, onto the mesh and apply the press. Remove the screen and allow to cool, or alternatively, fan up and down to accelerate the cooling process. Remove the sheet from the mesh in a smooth, even manner. 
you will then need to mask the outer areas and cover any blemishes. All the benefits of screen printing without the chemicals. This process makes high-quality full-color textile decoration simple and affordable for screen printers and results in a highly durable and stretchable finish that opens up a world of new opportunities and applications. For this application, you'll need the Pro 9541WT, a heat press, recommended media, glue and inks, and equipment typically used in a traditional screen printing environment, such as a screen printing hand bench, a screen printing frame, and a dryer. The artwork is printed mirrored onto the release liner media using the Oki Pro 9541WT printer. The printed color artwork is positioned face down on the hand bench under the screen printing frame with the stencil artwork. A suitable catalyst and retarder are added to the white water-based ink. This ensures good cross-linking adhesion at the pressing stage. The white ink solution is then screen printed through the stencil onto the artwork. The artwork, now coated in the white ink, is sprinkled with powder adhesive while still wet. If you don't have a powder applicator, this can also be done manually. The powdered print is then cured using a drying station or preferably a belt dryer. The transfer artwork is now ready to be applied to the intended end product via a heat press. Temperature, pressure and time will vary according to the particular press used. Remove from the press and allow to cool thoroughly before carefully peeling off. And there you have it vibrant colors with a soft and stretchable feel and high durability. Textile decoration without compromise.